All right, good morning, everybody. Um, so today I'm going to do a little quick review of uh, a comic that I just read. Um, we got Isom number one by uh, Eric July. Uh, artist Cliff Richards. I can't pronounce the other guy's name. Gabe L. L. Tabe. Um, I think they did a really, really fine job. Um, I love the coloring. The art's really great. Um, the story I thought was very, I mean, I was engaged with it. Um, it is a part one. There's the second part coming. Um, so you don't really get to know too much about the main character, but there's enough there to leave you wanting more. Um, and I'm sure we will find out more. Um, but for first issue, it's is pretty good. Um, that's really all I have to say about it. Um, because again, I just, this, I only read it once. This is just, uh, my first impressions, uh, of, of it. And, um, yeah, I thought it, I thought it was written pretty well. Um, it was all that he promised. No, none of this woke ideology in there, obviously. Uh, no politics, really. He's not preaching a message. He's just trying to tell a really fun story. Um, we don't get to know too much about the main character in here, but enough to want you to keep reading and find out more about him. Um, so, I can't wait for issue number two, really. Um, and I'm not just, you know, praising this just cause. Um, no, this is what I really thought about this. Um, if you have not picked up your copy yet, I highly suggest that you do. Way better. Uh, this will be way better than any modern comic that you will read from Marvel, DC. Um, it's just not full of crap. So, I'm interested to see where we, where he goes with this character. I know he's probably going to come up with other characters as well. You do get introduced to others in here. Um, so, I don't want to spoil too much about the story. Um, for those of you who may not have read it yet. Um, and those who may want to pick up a copy. Um, I, but again, I highly suggest that you do. And I am not much of a comic book person. I have always wanted to get into um, comics, especially like the old ones. Uh, so I've been kind of buying some old stuff and some like um, omnibuses and things. Uh, I've always been really curious about all my favorite uh, movies, uh, superhero movies that are out there, you know, their origins, you know, the comics that they came from. Um, maybe one day he will make or somebody will make a movie out of this. Uh, hopefully if this company grows and uh, I will continue to support independent creators like that. And that's what we must do. Um, so I highly recommend it. Go out and get a copy. Read it. Uh, Ripperverse.com And uh, yeah, that'll be all. Thank you for uh, watching this video, and I will see you again later. And until then, have a good night.